Hi, welcome to my channel. I titled this one, Meet Miss Thinking of a Master Plan. So my name is Miranda and I am very new to the YouTube community and I've been a part of the planning scene since um, I would say January of 2017. So this channel is designed for all things planner related. So that is when I can't find planner peace that's planner hauls, franken planning, stickers, stamping, anything planner related, that's what you're going to find on my channel. So a little bit about me. Um, like I said, my name is Miranda. I am the mother of um, two children, naturally. Um, two girls, 24 and 25 years old. And then I have two children, um, eight years old and 14 years old. And they, I, they're naturally my children, but I didn't naturally give birth to them. I, I am married and I've been married for seven years. And um, let's see, I am five years, five months, and five days older than my hubby. So I'm a cougar or whatever, um, but it's been good. I, I really can't complain. Um, so you met one of my, um, my children, which is Marley. He's the eight year old. A young man that comes um, to stay with us on his breaks his school breaks and he is just awesome and being that I've had girls um, that little man just loves me differently than those girls um, he's constantly coming in checking on me mom do you need anything mom are you okay are you all right okay I'm just checking um, I work from home um, a lot so when he's here I do spend a lot of time with him so um, he's very respectful very mannerable um, we live in the South. Uh, so he's being raised in the South. I'm actually in South Carolina. Um, we live in North Carolina. Um, but so he says, yes, ma'am, no, ma'am, you know, things you just don't find nowadays. And everywhere we go, people are always raving about his manners. He um, opens doors, he holds doors. Love that little guy. Can't say enough positive things about him. Um, so on to planning. So let's talk about my name a little bit, Miss Thinking of a Master Plan. So as I was um, starting to see that I needed to create me a, an online um, page, I wanted a name that would stick out and mean something to me. So I've always loved that old school song, Thinking of a Master Plan by Eric B. and Rakim. And so I looked for the name and it's out there. So that's how Miss Master Plan came. Maybe one day I will really have a master plan and I will share that master plan with you guys. Um, a little bit about how I got into planning is um, back in 2016, I have um, people on my team at work that were transitioning from being salary to hourly. And so, you know, when you're salary, you have a little bit more of a cushion. You could take an hour and 15 minute lunch break. Uh, you can come in late you know, leave early, just as long as the time balance is out in the end. So they were very accustomed to doing this for years. And so to have to go from a place where they didn't really have to be great managers of time, even though they didn't have work-life balance, um, to a place where you had to because we had no approved overtime. Um, so it's something that I found that I was able to share with them. Now, fun fact. I was perusing YouTube, looking up couponing tips and uh, coupon breakdowns. And one of the um, ladies' channels that I used to watch, um, and if I could find her, I would still watch her, by the way. Um, she had a couponing video, but she had something with planner. It was a happy planner. And she had blinged it all out, and she had decorated it. And I've been hooked ever since. So um, I went out initially and I purchased um, a Target dollar spot planner to use as my work planner and wanted to show the team an inexpensive way to manage their day. And you know what? They got there. Um, they are great managers of their time, you know, over a year later now. Um, they have work-life balance. They're working eight hours a day. They're taking lunch breaks every day instead of working through their lunch. And the complaints that I get are much less than they were before. Um, so... Some of them went and bought the Target dollar spot planners. Those that weren't able to buy it, I bought it for them. 
and then I purchased myself a Hello 2017, the planner box kit that had the stickers, the magnetic bookmark, and that's how I got started. Now, washi tape, addicted. Like I have, I don't know, probably, this is an estimate, three, 400 rolls of washi tape that I've acquired within the last year of planning. I absolutely love it. I can't stop buying it. I rationalize it, but I use it. I use it on my spreads. And you guys, as I post more plan with me's, you will see that I actually use it. Um, I started 2017 with two planners, that Target Dollar Spot planner for work and um, my Hello 2017 Happy Planner. So I kind of started adding more planners to my lineup. I think by the end of 2017, I had about, hmm, I'm gonna say six planners. And um, for 2018, my lineup has nine planners, technically 10 if you include the Franken Plan um, Classic. And if you talk about my Chunky Mini, I have three planners in there. So really like 12, but, in nine planners so um it's gonna be a challenge i think it's gonna be fun to see how i manage all of them and if i'm going to keep all of them we'll see where i'm at at the end of the year so um, i do really enjoy the happy planner simply because i think that it's versatile you can make it what you need it to be um the fact that you can take the pages out i did try a recollections spiral bound planner i had purchased for one of my daughters um she did not like it and I tried to use it as my social media planner from November to December of 2017. And I just didn't like it. I just can't get past that coil in the middle. I, it, it's just not customizable enough for me. So um, that's a little bit about my planning and my planner and my channel. So I appreciate you guys tuning in. Um, I am trying to do better about a, finding a... a um, a happy medium to get my social uh, media activity up. Um, I do have an Instagram page. It's at Mrs. Thinking of a Master Plan. And I do post my spreads and things there. Um, and of course I have the YouTube channel, but the social media thing, it is a challenge for me. I'm not a shy person at all, by no means. Um, <laughs> but it seems that I am trying to get warmed up to people in the planning community by being more active on Instagram. I belong to several Facebook groups and I've um, started to become vocal in those groups of, I would say as of the last two to three months um, before I kind of just watched everybody else and things like that. But now I, I do have a contribution and you know, I think my planner style is different. Everyone's planner style is different. That's what's great about the planner um, community and planning. There's no right and wrong way to do it. Whatever's right for you is what's right. Um, so I always remember that, especially you newbies, but anyway, I'm not going to chat your ears off all day. I thank you for taking the time to sit with me and learn a little bit about me. If you have any questions, feel free to comment below. Otherwise, please like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much. Bye.